Office Space must be one of the best comedies I've seen. Uh, it's not a uh, I want to make you a road on the floor um, comedy, but it's um, it's an it's a it's a nice story and it makes you laugh a lot because of the characters and not not particularly because of what happens to them. So um, the character writing is very cool. I, I, I'm, I'm not sure what was first, uh, the British Office uh, TV show or this movie, but um, it has some similarities. And I've had the privilege of working in an office space for a few years. And there is so many things in the movie that you can absolutely re relate to. Um, all the prob pretty much all the problems he had were things that uh, you can experience in an in a normal office jobs a job at least the one I had, and um, it, so this makes the the movie so much more uh, funny and relatable. Uh, even the boss uh, who comes in and um, makes you do things that are just procedure and that are just that make no sense if if you don't uh, uh, if you think about it too much so um, all those things are very funny also as I said the characters um, I think every office space has at least two or three people in it that are very similar to to a few of these characters um, especially the one you know I'm, I'm gonna set the, the house on fire uh, th th this guy is in every office and it's very funny. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to rate this one as one of the best comedies I've ever seen, uh, really, honestly. Um, there is no doubt that uh, it's better than premature, but it's, it's actually comedy, and it's, it actually makes you laugh. And it doesn't make no sense at all. Um, there is this thing in the movie, I'm trying again not to spoil too much, but uh, there is this thing in the movie that happens that makes the lead character change and see things differently and this event uh, is the the pivot is the the one thing that changes you know how the story evolves and it becomes pretty much obsolete after a, a, a time he he think he starts thinking about things again and i didn't quite understand um when that happened and why and if they just dropped it and just went with okay let's just stop doing that now and and make a make a story that builds up uh builds upon all the things that happened from from the event on so uh, i didn't quite understand that but who cares it's a comedy movie and um uh I, there were were there characters in there i mean except for dr cox i didn't recognize anyone and uh, it still um, made me laugh a lot. The, the, the best scene, the best scene in the movie, and one of the best comedic scenes I've ever seen, is the rap scene in the, in the pre-movie credits. The, the rap uh, guy, the white guy who raps and stops listening to the record and, and rapping because there's a black dude coming by uh, trying to clean his window from the car. And uh, that was I. That was a great starter for the movie, and uh, there was there was there wasn't a bigger laugh after that. I have to say, and it's not a it's not it's not one of those movies that make that make you just s scream and that make you just laugh out loud. But um, it's fun. It's a it's a fun movie. Maybe it's more a fun movie than a comedy movie. Not so sure. Um, <clears throat> so, so yeah, very good choice by you. I am um, again uh, trying to give you a movie that is honestly one of the best movies I have ever seen. It's not a comedy movie at all, and yes, it is a Werner Herzog movie. And is it? Yes, and it is also a Klaus Kinski movie. And I've been thinking a lot about what kind of movie I should give you. Um, I uh, with Klaus Kinski. I always said I you're gonna get a Klaus Kinski movie once one day, and it could be a punishment. I could gi could give you a Giri the Wrath of God, which is uh, also a great. It's a masterpiece, but 
hey, um, you're not gonna like it. But Wojtzeck, Wojtzeck is a German movie, should be out there in, in English for all the, the English speaking folks, but uh, it's a German movie based on a Polish book. I'm not sure. I don't ask me. But um, yeah, it's it's a movie that is based on a book that is later has later been uh, turned into a um, theater piece, and it's filmed pretty much that way. And it's maybe one of the movies where Kinski is giving his best performance and also giving uh, getting the best reaction by his um, by his um, uh, actors that play with him. So, um, very good movie. You might hate it. You just might hate it. So, I don't know. Um, I hope you do like it. I'm gonna try to get you a clip of that. I'll t I said I'd try because I'm, I'm having a new thingy here and I'm not sure um, how to do this yet. But, if you see a clip, you see the clip. And if you don't, you just have to watch the movie anyways. So um, have fun with Wojtek and see you next week.